let's see what we got oh that's a good one in terms of difficulty hello all right let me kill my flashers what i'm gonna do is i gotta split the tractor from the chassis and container but that thing is under immense amounts of pressure so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna use my truck to stabilize it so when i pull the fifth wheel it isn't ricochet recoil damage and kill someone all right let's pull over right here wow that's a tight spot let's get over this is what i mean by pressure if i disconnect it now this thing's gonna fly up uh shock load it could even move the container some We gotta assume it's it's 50 to 60,000, Carlos. They said it's uh, packed with boxes, not sure the weight. Okay, never mind. I was thinking if we disconnect it from there, if the container will roll down more, but no. That's a good spot. So first things first is let's connect my deck winch. I'm gonna run a snatch block to the bottom, to right here, and then a boom line. On the deck winch, pull out my deck winch, please, the green one. On the opposite, the, the green one right here. The deck winch. It should be freeze pull. There you go. Let me see it, please. All right, and then take apart the snatch block. Now the thing is, where passenger or driver's side? Right here, right here for sure. Okay, let's do it on the floor right here. Make it easier. Go for it, set it up. While I drop my outriggers. Let's drop the underlip more, all the way down. All right, you see where this shackle is? Put it on that side. So just take it off and put it on the same spot but opposite end, please. Get this out of the way, really good and low. Same spot, there you go. And the snatch block gets attached to that. Now I gotta see where I'm gonna hook up here. I could put a chain. Look at this, perfect. I like that a lot. I like that little spot. I'm probably gonna use a, I'm gonna use a half inch chain right there. All right. I don't know, I don't know anything. You ready? I'm gonna start going out. <clears throat> I don't know anything. I know. <laughs> That's good. Okay. Now put the grab hook towards the tail end about five five links in at least on the strong side not on the weld right there's great <clears throat> now let me winch in I'm gonna put just the tiniest amount of pressure okay Hector let it go perfect let go right there got it <clears throat> Now I need one more, um, a vertical for a catch. Just in, let's use a, where, where, where? Too many choices, Josh. That back hole right there, perfect. Let me stand right here. I'm connected, good. Carlos, do me a favor. The big toolbox that's open. Um, give me any strap. Or you know what? No, I have a... Because we got to pull the fifth wheel, but I don't want you standing close. Grab something. 
Were there a chain or? I'll go under it. And pull it from there? Yeah. Give me a half inch chain. Hanging on the right hand side. Oh. All right, I got tension on the green. Go for it. Let me let out a little bit. Here, I got an idea. Let me pick up on this end to make it more straight, yeah? Okay, try that. <clears throat> Perfect. Look at that. Leave everything the way it is. Now as they let out with the green, uh, look at it, it's already recoiling. Okay, Hector. Okay, <clears throat> Drive the tractor out. All right, fine, we're great. I have a little bit of slack right there on the green. Let me see if I can actually tighten it up. Because once he pulls forward, there's nothing stopping that thing from slamming up. the axles buddy have him lock the axles all right not gonna work and instead of keep sliding in my outriggers all I gotta do is toy with the cables I'm gonna lift up the entire truck. Push it over. Much better. I think I'm happy with that. Try it now. Go, just two feet. I double checked the the fifth wheel, I don't think it was in the unlock position. It was pulled, but let's see if that fixed it. <laughs> oh, no. Hold it, hold it. Back up. And I missed that. That thing wasn't budging at all. So we just used big flippers since it was right there to, to tug on it, to winch it. Pull them out. <clears throat> and as I walk back, boom, I hear the snap. It caught great, as you can see, to prevent it from recoiling, hitting the truck, and causing all kinds of damage. <laughs> all right, step one is done. Now we got to separate it up here. That's going to be fun. What I'll do is uh, I'll have Hulk back up. Yeah, I'll back up really good. And attach to here. So you guys are just gonna take the chassis and the container, not the truck, right? So is that means we could get one of our drivers to come get it, or how does that work? That's fine, yeah. It's just yeah? the tractor, the chassis yeah, and the container. Driver. Okay, so let's send a driver. Okay. Right, thank you. You gotta be kidding me. So the tractor pulled out, you see that piece of wood? Don't tell me that was a thing holding us back from that tractor driving forward. That tractor wouldn't budge, dude. It was just spinning. Did he lock you know, the axles? He locked the axles and he dropped the pusher. 
the booster. But Flipper just winched it out. All right, good. Yo, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna disconnect. Okay. Back up Hulk. And I'm gonna put my lines up there so when we take off the locks, it won't fall over. While Flipper takes my position and holds the front. Okay. I don't want this thing to slam or go crazy. A lot of tension, heavy. I'm rigged. I got Flipper in the front to stabilize because this thing is mad crooked. You see how we let it go and it hasn't corrected? This thing's, this thing's done for. It's a roller coaster track now. All right, Joe, let me put tension first and then I'll have you jump up. I got the 15 foot doubled up for the top just to get that extra height. And my six foot container thing on the bottom. So as it comes over, we'll have a full control. I'm not taking any chances with this sucker. That's fine, Joe. It's a good idea. But let out on the green when you do that. Okay. You got a sledgehammer? Yeah, I got this right there. I'm good here. This sucker's not coming over. Not on my watch. Tight enough, if anything, on your red. Keep your red more tight. Right. right there, right there. Okay. All right. You want to start with the top or the bottom? Smart. Hey, what kind of container locks are those? I never seen these. Is it already out? It looks like it's out, Joe. Oh, Alright, be careful. Tension. You, have to it. you got it, going up. Stand clear. Huh? If you can get it and move it, I'll pull it out. No more pressure. Come on. Carlos, give me a uh, big flipper's remote. I'm going to use flipper. I need flipper for that. Let me see. All right. You got your outriggers out good? Yeah. All right. Bring it back. There it is, right there. Ha <laughs> ha! Hey, I was right. I was right. Uh, you're good, Joe. Let me get the bottom. You got it. Yes, yeah, the locks are still done here. So, hold on, wait. All right, now we can pull it out. It's undone? This one's unlatched already, yeah. You want the... No, it's unlatched though. We just, now you gotta... I will, I will. What you're gonna do, Joe, suck in. I'm is just gonna hold it. Rotate that way a little bit more. Counterclock. It's actually clockwise, like if you're, uh, yeah, imagine it's a clock. Now extend out. That one, yes. Good, good, great, great. Like that. That's amazing. That's now leave good. it there. In the event it falls over, it's not gonna hit flipper because it's parked far ahead. Let me close my toolbox. All right, you ready? I'm ready. You gotta do nothing. You just I leave it like nothing. that. I'm just gonna go up on hey, the Hey, you know what? Let out, let out on both cables so it'll catch itself in that behind the guardrail. Okay. On the other one, the green one only. Green one only. Right, okay, right there. That's good. Now put a little tension on the green so it's not free spool. Right. Good, great. Ready? Oh, yeah. Okay, ladies, stand clear. Oh, 
That's walk. scary. Go in on the blue. Yeah, my catch right there, I'm gonna go out on the blue. And go up on this one. Now in, up. Look at that, man. Easy, easy. easy, easy. God, I love being so safe. Okay, Joe, boom up. In on the boom no, boom up, boom up. On three, two, one, go. Great. Now you just hold it there for me. Let me flip it in midair for me. I, I control the back because it's heavier. Now, if anything, let me get this stuff out of the way. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna, what you're gonna do is swing it the opposite way. Ready? Let's go. Swing, 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 swing. Swing my boat? Yes, back, back towards it, like that, like that. I want the tires to land in back of my outriggers, okay? You're doing great. Okay, that's perfect. Now what you're gonna do is drop down on your red only a little bit. Good. Good, good, good. Now keep it there. Not yet, Joe, because it's so twisted. Okay, help me by going out with the red more. Go, 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 go. Red, red, red out, red out, red out. You see? I okay, now rotate a little bit more to the back. I want it away from the guardrail. You're good, Joe. Now let me do all the catching up, okay? You hold yours, Joe, in the air so you guys can do the uh, landing gear. Let me do the landing gear. I'm gonna go down with the I was very textbook. All right. Things are going good. Step one was a tractor. Done. Step two was a chassis. Done. I got my wrecker back there. We're gonna tow it out. He's gonna tow it out. And then uh, step three is the container. This is gonna be hard. We're on the slope. Here's the freeway here. Um, I got a couple of plans. I'm gonna do some mental walk through right now and see which one's my favorite. Right, ready to go down. <clears throat> Good, keep going, keep going. It's so twisted, we gotta do it. Okay, now let out with your red. Good, hold it. Just hold it there, Joe, you're doing great. Let me catch up. <laughs> you see how twisted it is? That... Yeah, I know. Joe, what we're gonna do, we're, we're gonna push this to the guardrail so Hector can get in with 66 and tow it out. We're gonna make room for you, Hector, to, to get in front of it. Hector, can, can you tow this? Yeah. Yeah. You, you can tow anything. I know. You're the best. I, I, I tow a bus this morning with five. Yeah, you go high on it. That's it. We know. All right. Let's get the truck. So we're going to move the rotator so the record can get through. Yeah, have him move the bike, please, Hector. Yeah. He's in my trunk. All right. Uh, this is going to be tough. We're going to get the chassis out of the way. Now, obviously, there's no room to back up to this thing. Not that I do that anyways. I prefer working off the side. You got a rotator. Use it. But once we set up and we flip it, I mean, we can skillfully put it in between the outriggers if we distance enough, but how's the land all gonna back up underneath? So I got a plan. Either we flip it, we put it here, and then we use flipper to only lift up the front high enough so the land can back up under it with it sloped, or I just do a, a mid-air roll. Incredibly risky, <clears throat> but I got the trucks for it, the power for it. What that means is I'm going to flip this thing and right before it touches the land all, 
we just raise up and we keep flipping it in air <clears throat> i'm gonna try that it's a pro move it's gonna look cool and like i said i got the power for it he's in hector's truck hector's gonna get him right now what's in there did you open it no is it loaded i don't see a sale no it's fully loaded the lady said it's, it's like boxes she doesn't know what light boxes she said all right i'm gonna try that then i feel comfortable doing that with my trucks before i do that though well you know what the guardrail is already toast they're gonna have to repair this whole section anyways That'll be Countrat's job. I was thinking of, uh, before we do the flip, is to push it off the guardrail and start right there. Start in the dirt on the inside of the guardrail. Then as it comes over, like I said, I catch it, then lift up again and, and keep flipping it in midair. Instead of using the, the four to pivot it. Yeah, we can do that. Good job, Hector. We got it hooked up. Looking like a big old mess. Getting a little nervous. It's game time. Now, is that a Frankenstein toe or what? Oh, he's doing it backwards. He's supposed to be going forward. Oh, he'll make it. <clears throat> Let's see what he's doing. So once this sucker's out of the way, it's setting up the, the rotators. See, I already got my 40,000 pound in a vertical loop. We're gonna use both of these to bring it over with some container sinks for the catch to perfect the mid-air roll. Now on this end, I don't think I gotta push it over more, but the other side I might. I don't want it to start coming over and then it falls off the, the curb. <clears throat> Good. all right guys this is a lot of quick 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 work i don't have the gopro for this part but as you can see we backed up the lando then extended the outriggers horrible working environment look at this there is an option of disconnecting the tractor but that takes too long i'm here i'm happy let me just make sure flippers on platform is stabilized You know what, I'm gonna get my headsets for the actual flip. antennas because I'm gonna have you stand on the opposite side man on most jobs like when I'm working with Dave we're just so in sync we don't really really need headsets and we're in close quarters but on this one I'm a bit nervous there we go so I need to be on a perfect communication with Joe let's throw it on buddy Testing, testing. Work. Like this. You got it backwards, homie. This goes on the right hand side, like that. There you go. <clears throat> Let me know when you got it. I'm gonna just adjust mine and put it tighter. 
You got it? You got it? Yeah, I could hear you. Can you hear me? Okay, Joe, you stand on your side. Let me know when you get there. Stay right there. All right, moment of truth, guys, moment of truth. <clears throat> Carlos, do me a favor, stand right there between the trucks. Let me know if they start leaning heavy. Okay. It, it's, it's gonna pull us, but I'm gonna try to power through it safely. Remember, Joe, your, uh, how your snatch blocks are opposite. All right, I got tension. I'm, I'm good to go. How are you? Are you ready? 640. <clears throat> okay. Joe, your container sling, don't worry about your catch for now. Let's worry about the orange sling only. You know which one that is? Joe. That black thing, push it up. Give yourself slack on that, let out on that and push it up. It's gonna rub hard at the top. All the way up. Give yourself slack. Other one, Joe, like that, yeah. Keep, keep giving yourself slack. Okay, now, now tighten up, buddy. You're only going in with that one, okay? Are you ready? All right, three, two, one, lift. All right, it's it's spiking exponentially. I'm already at 11,000, 10,000 pounds of force. Keep it up, keep it up. It's all right. Good idea. <clears throat> Just do both at the same time. Not bad. I'm only I'm only at 6,200 pounds now. Now that you're helping me, we're doing great, man. We're doing great. Don't let your catch get too loose, okay? In fact, let's let's hold it. Me too. Great idea. Not too tight though. All right, there. Let me know when you're ready to proceed. <clears throat> oh, ready, go. I don't need to hold this anymore. Okay, Joe, now this part, hold it. Now put tension on your uh, catch. <clears throat> it there let me catch up what I'm gonna do hold on I'm gonna boom down okay so just keep yours like that oh this is fun huh <laughs> Ready, go in with the li lift. Now Joe, hold it. No, no, your catch, your catch. Your catch is too loose, there. Now start going in more. Hold it, Joe. Let me catch up, okay? Mm. Now 
Now this part's gonna be the, the hard part. At the same time, we're gonna go in with lift and catch, okay? Go, let's go. Lift and catch. That whole catch up, it's stuck on the guardrail. Lift and catch, Joe, at the same time. It's all right. How are you coming along? It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Joe, hold it right there. Let's rotate towards me, towards the back. Three, two, one, go. There you go, buddy. Hold it. All right. In with both cables, please. In. In, in, in. We're almost at the perfect height. <clears throat> All right, now catch only, go. I mean, lift only. Yes, sir. All right, now let's start letting out the catch at the same time. You're doing awesome, Joe. All right. Me too. Not bad, huh? <laughs> ah, they don't care. It's all right. My YouTube fans hopefully will care. That's beautiful. Joe, I'm gonna. When you're ready, we're both gonna boom up and in, okay? Three, two, one, boom up. That's great. Let me go first because we're crooked, okay? You hold it. Your turn. In. Slowly in, Joe. Only in, not boom up. Very slowly. <clears throat> it's not recommended, but we gotta... We're pretty much straight, Joe. Carlos, how's the container from hitting the land all? Not yet. Let me go down with mine, okay? How are you looking with space, Joe? Okay, go up with the boom first. Go up. So we're completely airborne off the land all. All right. There, I just gave you a little nudge. How's that? Nah, negative. I don't want it all the way forward. I don't want it to hit. How are you looking there? Yeah, go up. Go in and up, Joe. Let's do you let's do the front first, Joe. Why don't you stand on the opposite side so you can see? Just keep going in then. All the way. You're ready. Let's drop this baby. In, in. Okay, up, up. Amazing, amazing. Okay, there. Cable only. Side's perfect, Joe. You gotta go up and in now, okay? I'm, I'm set and I'm done. I'm waiting on you. You got it, buddy. Just keep pushing it over like that. Up and in. Flippers got it. You're good. Fiend. 
it's a, it's a oh yeah and you can get the you're good jump up there joe we're gonna start uh disconnecting everything good job bro. good job good job appreciate that bro thank you thank you was a good plan it worked out great joe's up there taking everything off um the trucks held well i'm very impressed with hulk very impressed with flipper uh joe did great following my lead it wasn't the fastest we've done but on this you know speed's never the name of the game we're all about perfection and being smooth as much as we can i still got a lot to learn but I think I did great on this one. I was very happy with that mid air roll. That's fine, leave it like that. It won't come out. <clears throat> so now I'm gonna put the trucks away and then I'll get back to you guys when we're ready. Good job, Joe. Secure? All right, they're gonna run some chains up top. We're only going, uh, GPS is 13 minutes in current conditions. By my Wilmington shop from last week's video. Trucks are put away. Man, we did excellent timing for what this was. We took precision and finesse to a whole new level. All right, guys. We'll get back to you when we get to the customer's yard. And the convoy begins. Thank you guys. John's Joe's gonna be doing the repair. Uh, Joe's gonna be driving the land on Carlos Big Flipper. So from here it's Easy Street. I think we get off two exits from here and take the street towards my Wilmington shop. Now if I heard right, this company has a, a flipper. Not big flipper, but to flip the container and put it on the chassis so we don't need the rotators for that. Well, off we go, we'll see. All right, we're just posted up outside the customer's yard. I'm trying to see what's going on. Oh yeah, that's a big yard. Wow, even better. We don't need the rotators. Hulk and Flipper, you worked enough. Let them take it off for you. So Joe's just gonna take off the chains. They're gonna lift it up, he pulls out, and then they uh, back up the chassis. And now they get the customer for payment, and we're out of here. Hope you guys enjoyed. We're out.